Hello Shopify enthusiastic! Today let's addressing a crucial aspect of e-commerce adding the best currency converter to your Shopify store. I am Steven and you're going to be watching another informative tutorial. So stick around because I'm going to be guiding through the steps of the Enhage Your Store's accessibility for international customers. So let's get started. Now before we dive into the tutorial, let's understand we're having robust currency converters crucial for your Shopify store. Usually the impact of customer experience and global sales are going tremendously enormous. So when people are getting your store, usually Everybody just works with USD dollars, but this is not an exemption for whatever people who are working in here. So when they are checking out products, usually they work with different currencies. And when you see, when the customers see that they have a currency they don't work with, uh, maybe you might be having an advantage to cause because people are lazy. They don't want to check that out. They wanted to see all the information in just one place. That's the reason why I wanted to add a currency conversion into our store. So let's get started to implement uh, our actual own store with some currencies converter. So not all currencies converter apps are created equal. Let's explore how to choose the best one of your specific needs. So choosing the best currency converter app. To do this, what I wanted to do is to go here into my Shopify. I'm going to leave you guys a link down below in the description so you can all get started totally for free. And once you are having here your Shopify store, let's go here into Add Applications. And here into Add Applications, I choose the Shopify App Store. Inside the Shopify App Store, usually what I do to find the best application for my needs is to go here into the Search Apps Guides and more. Now here, let's go for a actual currency word. So I go for currency only. And then as you can see, we have the Transi AI language translate, currency converter, uh, language translator, currency converter plus, and so much more. Usually that would be more than enough to look out for something which is totally for free and built for Shopify. So I enable this category by here into continue. And here I'm gonna type converter to filter this a little bit much more uh, now. So now as you can see here, we have the page fly, the box, and much more. Usually what you want to do is to find an application that has really strong great reviews, strong ratings, and a free plan available. If this one has a free trial for a specific date, you don't want it to enter that info. You want it to look out for an application that can be helping you to do this totally for free with no um, trial mode or anything. So as you can see, the box currency so far actually works for free. So let's go here into install. Uh, let's just grant the access of your application directly into your website. After you make the quick installation of your application, then we're moving on to the installation and configuring the currency converter. Now comes the exciting part. We'll walk you through the installation and, prog and configuration of all the choosing currency converter app for your Shopify store. So watch this closely and you'll soon offer a seamlessly multi-currency experience to your customers. First of all, if you wanted to take a quick tour, you can just import it. In my case, I'm going to go here into setting up the money format. So here into the money format, you wanted to go here into the Shopify settings, general, underscore currency, choose the change formatting and copy and paste the below modified money formats to uh, this one. So. I copy this one. I'm going to open this into a new tab. And as you can see here into the settings, and we have the store details. Now here into the changing format, as they told us to do, you wanted to go here into HTML with currency. I copy it with currency. I paste this info. Now here into HTML without currency, I copy it and I paste it in here. After that, let's go back and say, next, I have done this. Then we needed to enable the theme app extension. To enable the theme app extension, what you want to do is to click into this link. This should be sending us into the editor and opening automatically the app and beamed into the web pod. So what you want to do is to enable the box section that appears here and hit now into safe. After that, let's go back. Let's say that you have already done that. 
uh, this shall be appearing as completed. Lastly, you need to enable the application. Hit into enable once again, enable the application and grant the access. After that, here you can see that here it should be appearing the currencies that you can accept here into your account. For example, we have the US dollars, there's the euro, there's a the British pound. You can add more to more if you wanted to and turned on. So after that, I'm going to hit now into save and there we go. So just make sure that you have checked out the save button, go into view. And if you check out here your catalog, I'm going to go here into my products. You should see here that I have now the currency of the MXN. This is totally based into where I'm based at. So as you can see, here's the actual price of the product. And here's actually appeared into USD dollars. I'm going to change this into Canadian dollar, for example, and check how, how it's going to be looking out to location, of course. So it actually looks really great now. It actually helps me a lot with our um, currencies and all of that. So guys, congratulations, because we have successfully added the best currency composer to our Shopify store. Your customers will now enjoy a tailored shopping experience in the preferred currency. If you want to change more stuff, you can always go back into the website, into the application that you have installed it. You can see there have different designs that we can change. We can change this play if you wanted to and so much more. But in my case, I'm going to just leave this like that and do this for another tutorial. So guys, uh, just in case you have any questions, you can leave it all below into the comments below. If you find this tutorial helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more Shopify insights. Remember, you have the link down below in the description so we can all get started with the Shopify store website. And well, guys, your global reach just got broader, right? So until next time, happy selling.